everyone welcome back to another episode so I'm trying to hold the 360 camera and doing the unicycle in uh, try and take you along for the ride so um, yeah getting better um, my knees aching more about that later um, but yeah frill spills crashes knees keep it here <laughs> So apart from a couple of idiots on bikes, like wobbling their bikes to make me fall off, even though I didn't fall off, dicks. Um, yeah, not too bad, about a mile and a half along this thing. Bus. Slow bus, of course. Um, the only downside to using this, I don't want to go too far until I'm too kind of confident in that you have to share it with nice bike riders and um, potentially not so nice bike riders. I'm not going to use the word that I use for them. Um, but yeah, building my confidence, I'm still very wobbly. Now I don't know whether that's, I just need to take my, check my tyre pressure or whether my footing isn't quite right. Um, I'll try and get some shots of my feet and maybe somebody out there can give me some pointers and tips. Thank you to the people that have already given me some pointers and tips, really helpful. Nice. 
another bus. Um, thank you for the encouragement from uh, spinning my wheel and uh, the um, tutorial stuff from Ustride. Really, really helpful. Really appreciate that. Um, worth noting as well, I did accidentally twist my knee last week. Um, it's not too bad at the moment. It's aching, but I'm trying to take it easy. Um, I was mucking around on grass with the unicycle, which is a bit stupid, and the unicycle twisted quickly. My knee twisted the other way, so it's been in a bit of a bandage thing for a couple of days. Um, but yeah, we'll see how we go. So, first couple of slopes as well, so for start. ready for that one yet. Learn unless you're falling, hey? Oh, damn it. Damn it, Kevin. Falling for you again. 
A little stumble on the bridge my own fault well kind of wobbled and then turned and then kind of fell nothing too serious just my pride and a little bit shaky just need to get back on but uh hey you don't learn unless you fall eh stretch my knees starting to wake a little bit so like I said I'm gonna take it easy I'm gonna go back to the car park and do some a few laps of here as well but improvement I haven't been on this since when was it it was either end of last week or beginning of this week so this is technically day six if you take out the fall that twisted my knee <laughs> um, so week two week two um, absolutely loving it once you get a kind of flow it feels amazing um, I just need to work out getting rid of these bloody wobbles I'm gonna check my tire pressure tonight see if that's part of it and maybe my foot stance and strength 
Time to practice a bit more and maybe some turns. too bad I'm turning left up here to have a bit of an issue so I need to practice that more but this car box perfect for practicing um, it's a couple of miles down from well, about a mile from where I work when I am in the office and the weather's like this it's it's ideal um, I'll only do a few little bits of the Cambridge run just because it's not fair on cyclists when I'm trying to learn and wobbly and you know they zoom past and stuff I don't want to get in their way, crash into them or rest that sort of stuff. So when it's quiet, I'll try that. And then once I've got my confidence um, up, I'll do that.
I mean this is this is the car park so nice open space and there's a, a 16 oh, 14 16 mile cycle path that basically goes from here in St Ives to uh, Cambridge that we usually do on the boards did like this episode don't forget to do all the lovely normal stuff like share subscribe click the notification icon you can donate to the channel if you uh, so wish using buy me a coffee link in the description